Oh. Oh. It's working. <laughs> I was starting to wonder. <laughs> I kept trying to check on my end. Okay. Hey. I have not done a video game stream. Actually, I haven't done content on this channel at all in uh, that minute. Um, but I just felt like uh, running one real quick. <laughs> Funny enough, I do have a few videos on unlisted. I just kind of want to test the quality of my streams real quick. Like. I just want to see if my live stream is just going to die. Because I would like to live stream Godzilla at some point this week before the movie. Uh, I don't know if that'll be Thursday or Wednesday night. But at some point this week, I would like to live stream Godzilla at some point. So I just kind of want to real quickly see if my live stream is just going to have a stroke. <laughs> So I thought, what what better game to do? Because this one requires a lot of online, and if any any game would kill my uh, would kill the live stream and the gameplay, it would easily be this one. Hey Phoenix, what's up, man? Yeah, I'm just gonna stream for a little bit. I just kind of want to test the quality a bit. I mean, hey, if the quality goes well, maybe I'll stream for a bit today. But I at least just want to see how long it takes for a live stream of mine to just collapse <laughs> so it's like because i've been having a, actually have been having a lot because i used to live stream a lot back in the day i'm sure a lot of you guys remember but like i just been having so many wi-fi issues over the years so i eventually just gave up but let's try it i i noticed you ron why don't you get in here man um How's everyone's day going though? Um, I so, so I woke up a few hours ago. Uh, I I won't. <laughs> uh, hey Ron, do you know there's a movie coming? I didn't know if you knew there was a movie coming, Ron, but there's a movie coming out. Did you know there's a movie coming? But yeah, as for GXK, I got my tickets for Thursday night. I haven't really been tracking news on the channel. I know. It's not like GVK, I just haven't really been taking the time as much. When I, uh, usually when I get off work, I just have some fun. Like, I just go do something. Play some games or draw or anything. Two people brought that offering. What? That's good, Phoenix. I didn't go to college. <laughs> so, I'm like, I went straight into full time. Which, I don't regret. But I do need to get. Has this new? Does anyone know if the new? Because I'm playing on PlayStation. Does anyone know if the new PS5 headsets came out yet? They looked really good. I'm not talking about the wireless like earbuds either. Like I'm not talking about like the uh, like the the AirPod looking things. I don't, not AirPod, but you know what I mean. Like the the earbuds. There was a new actual headset coming out, but. I was, I didn't know if anyone had possibly, ooh, whoops, <laughs> there's my playback, I didn't know if anyone knew any info on that, I don't know how many PlayStation players I got in my chat, okay, alright, the first thing I'm doing as soon as I get in this lobby is I'm checking my ping, because if my live stream doesn't die, my gameplay probably will, so, oh, this match is taking a good minute. Damn. Yeah, I get that. I'm in my own time. I'm doing some artsy fartsy things myself. Ooh, my ping is not too bad right now. Uh, I'm doing some artsy things in my own time too. I've been slacking the past few days a bit just because how tired I've been. Uh, how late I've been getting off. Like I've been working 12s the past few days, but I'm hoping to continue something like that. Is he on me? Interesting. Interesting. Oh my god. 
too early in the morning for this. I like this guy. But, yeah, I know, someone's using Oni, and he doesn't even have the, does he have the event skin? I can't even tell if he's using the event skin or not. I saw that, yeah, he has that bug where he's, like, immortal, if he has Nagret. I'm, anytime I see an Oni now, I kind of just wonder if that's what they're running, but I guess we'll find out here in a second. Oh, I'm Sam. Okay. This only is funny, though. Great job chasing me. Uh, so, it seems like so far my stream and gameplay is actually handling, which is quite surprising, because I've been kicked off the game a lot lately. But... I already wasted one pallet, too. I don't want to waste another one. Uh, you know, like I said, okay, going back to what we were talking about it, GRK. Yeah, I've been slacking on news. Um, so if there's anything you guys want to talk about really in the movie, go ahead and put it. I would prefer, not for my sake, but for other sake, you, you don't get in spoiler territory. But, uh, it's like, yeah, I've been... I think the last time I talked about GSK on the channel was when the figures came out, and that wasn't even me talking, that was me just doing a video showing they were out in the wild. Seems like the stream is still maintaining. Still don't know if this Oni is running Magrit and stuff yet. Oh, okay. Um, yeah, would you guys be down though for a, uh, a Godzilla stream possibly later this week? Even if it's not a long one, but I was like, I wouldn't mind playing some Godzilla and actually talking about the movie on the channel a bit. I haven't done that a lot, so it's like I said, I've been pretty inactive these past few months. If you, if you want to see where I'm active at, I'm usually pretty active on my Instagram um, and my Discord. And if you need a link to either or, let me know. But usually, I'm I'm being fairly active on those too. I've been posting a lot lately on my stories about GSK on Instagram, and then. On Discord, we're always talking, so it's just a lot easier for me to do it that way. Hopefully, at some point in the future, maybe I'll have the motivation and time to really put some more effort into content, or even just stream and stuff. Streaming wouldn't be bad. I I used to love streaming back in the day, but like I said, my Wi-Fi just could not handle it, so. I bought my tickets to go see my dad since he, since we the big guys owners of the house. Yeah, that's about what I'm expecting. I saw, you know, now that you say that, because like I said, I'm going Thursday, but I saw an article the other day of someone, they made an article saying that critics are like already giving like bad feedback from to GSK when you read it. It literally just says so far, like when you read the article, it just says that critics are saying it's not as good as minus one. Like, yeah, no duh. Like, you made an article on that? Like, we knew that was coming. Like, it is, it's a no-brainer. But, like, minus one is just so good. But, GSK just looks, in its own, like, in its own playing field, it looks very fun. Like, it, it looks like, I might get some slack tennis, but it looks like a, like, a better Final Wars? Is that what I want to say? I don't know if I want to say Final Wars. I mean... No, I wouldn't say Final Wars. I'd say it's closer to something like Destroy All Monsters in terms of pacing. 
Yeah, I don't know why they're making articles about comparing the two. Like, it's like, dude, we know. <laughs> like, we know. Um, but I'm gonna go watch it in IMAX D box seats on uh, this Thursday after work. I'm gonna get off work early um, that day, and then I'm going straight to the theater shortly afterwards. I might head up see if I can find any of the Funko Pops and stuff because I've been wanting the like the evolved Godzilla and stuff. Um, I'm gonna go see if I can find any of those Funko Pops and stuff. Um, but. I, oh my god, I wasn't expecting to get a slow vault. Okay. Um, but uh. Oh, what was I saying? I'm saying something. My, my brain melted <laughs> during that. Um. Also, cruise attention. Yeah, so I'm I'm pretty sure the 60 minutes of screen time is true. Seeing as what we've seen so far, it if it's right in that whole category of like I could e easily see that being true. I mean, probably why they're being more lenient what footage they're showing. To be honest, like. Why not? <laughs> you know, I mean, if you have that much kaiju screen time, you can literally show anything. Um, sure. uh, you can literally show anything and just not even like affect literally anything because there's so much stuff going on in the movie. You know, you're not really spoiling anything for anyone. Yeah, so I think that's just also comes with the fact that whenever you decide to go out of your way to make a movie with possibly 60 minutes of screen time for the kaijus and then while you're at it you're gonna throw uh you're gonna try to do this all in like a year and a half like i don't know how long they've been working on the visuals for this movie but you know how hard that is like think of and like a lot of the anime studios and stuff like a lot of those guys get like a year to like if not less um yeah sure are, are you if you're getting on right now you know what? Yeah, i'll back out i'll back out of this lobby but you get like a year or less like if, to make like a whole season of anime so it's like try to imagine that with a big cgi movie it's, i i think they should have gave them maybe another year and unlike anime, you're not going to get like a special Blu-ray version that fixes a lot of mistakes. I don't think. I feel like that's very unlikely. Uh, but despite the CGI issues, and also Wingard basically admitting he kind of wanted to put stuff on it that's going to make it like... It, it's going to make the CGI look a little bit, little bit rougher, the way he's doing it visually. Um, I mean... I, Again, I'm for the movie. Like, there are still some good-looking shots in the trailers. And on top of that, you have a bunch of daytime stuff, too, which, like, obviously, that's just gonna... Um... I'll do that. Obviously, that's just gonna cause a lot of issues, too. That's why you see so many darker movies. Because I think movies, like... I could be wrong. I think movies like Avatar and stuff, like, they get years to do the visual effects. And then, <laughs> this movie... Like... Again, G GVK came out in 21, and they didn't really start production on this movie, I don't think at all, until 22, right? I don't even remember when they announced it. Like, 22, I think, when... Was it 21 or 22 when the Son of Kong leaks were coming out? I don't, I don't quite remember. I'm, I'm trying. I'm honestly trying to remember here. Uh, let's see. You want to hop on a VC? We could try. <laughs> um, let me. 
my VC might die, but we can try that. Hold on. You know, I wish this was like Xbox, because on Xbox they have it where you can hook up Discord to, like, the console. I don't know if you've played it on Xbox, but... You're in my server, right? Uh... Yeah, we'll hop on VC. Actually, I'll just make a private VC with you. Yeah, I know you. I know you're on PC. I wish. I wish they would set up like PlayStation. No, I don't know why they haven't. I don't know if that's just because the way Xbox is. <laughs> like, because Xbox through PC. I'm gonna make a VC with you. I'll play for a bit. I started a VC with you, man. Alright. Cool. Um. A fire. Yeah. They're so lucky. I do hope the movie, though. <laughs> Again, I do hope the movie overall. I am excited. Like. I'm still excited for the movie. I, I would love a fun movie. Minus One was so good, but it's such a different, like, type of movie. And, like, it, it's honestly my favorite Godzilla movie. Like, I'm being real. Like, it became my favorite Godzilla movie. But, despite that, I know what GXK is. It's like, I'm gonna go watch it like that. Its goal is to entertain me. So if it doesn't entertain me, it failed. You know, while Minus One, it's like, its goal was to make you feel something. You know, stuff like that. If it didn't accomplish that, then it failed at what it was trying to be also, but it didn't do that for me. I, I trust me, I felt that movie. Um, so, I'm hoping this movie really, like, I'm hoping this movie entertains. And I think 60 minutes of over, if the whole thing of over being 60 minutes, I believe that's the longest screen time for monsters in any Godzilla movie. Which is crazy that a CGI Godzilla movie is the one doing that and not a Suitimation one. Because you'd think, like, the suit films would be the ones with, like, an absolute insane amount of screen time. I know, I think versus uh, Mechagodzilla 2, right? I think versus Mechagodzilla 2 was uh, the heaviest there for a while. That one had 30 minutes of kaiju screen time, I think. And GVK also had... Kong alone had 30 minutes of screen time in that movie. I remember that. Counting the other monsters was probably closer to like 40 minutes of screen time total with all the monsters. Because so much of his screen time was with the other monsters, but when they weren't with him, probably around like 40 minutes. So this one, this one has more kaiju screen time than the humans do on screen. I don't think that's ever happened before in a Godzilla movie. I could be wrong. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I think this is, if that's the case, this would be the first Godzilla Kong movie to have more kaiju than human stuff, and I'm it's trying to entertain me. I'm fine with that. Oh, yeah, I'm not downplaying suits at all. Um, I'm not downplaying suits, like, suits are I get that, you know, there's a reason we're moving the CGI, like, and it's more than just like, I mean, because CGI is still expensive as hell. I don't think people, some people don't understand that. Um, but practicality, like, you know, you had Godzilla actors almost drowning and stuff every movie in the suits, like, I completely understand why, uh, but at the same time, I was just like, I'm kind of surprised none of those, like, none of the cheaper Godzilla movies didn't just, Huntress, damn, uh, didn't just go fall to the wall with the screen time. Uh, Hunters can scare me a little bit, I'm not gonna lie. What outfit is that? 
Oh my god! Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Oh, that was a... I messed up. <laughs> that was a quick change. <laughs> but... <laughs> um, I'm curious though. So, I don't know if anyone... Again, I haven't really been talking about this stuff on my channel as much as I should be, but... There was a Toho Kingdom interview the other day, and I think Wingard kind of slipped up in it. Because we know when he has plans for a sequel, and he... To me, at least, like, and I, to a lot of other people who read it, it seems like a slip-up that he basically confirmed that his plan sequel involves a Toho monster. He won't say what it is, but... He did say... He did imply... Strongly imply that he has a Toho monster in mind for next movie, and he's a big Showa fan. So, I wonder, I was talking to some people, I know the two big guesses are Gigan and Hedora. I wouldn't be shocked to make along. I would, if it was up to me, I'd personally go Bio or Space. But Hedora is really good too. I think Orga is another cool one that you could easily fit in the verse. Um, you know, you could bring you could bring a Muto Prime in the live action and like have Orca evolve off her or something. Like there you go, that would explain why they look so similar. Like I feel like there's lots of I feel like there's a lot of code kind of you can make it work. I'm might get flack for this. I personally wouldn't want Destroya. Um I would hope they if they do bring him into the verse they hold off and don't do it the very next movie that's they got planned. Uh, what, but yeah, I would I would like Bio. I think Bio would be cool. I think, I think it's neat that Wingo's not one of those directors that relies on like after credit scenes to like, set up everything. But he also normally doesn't exactly set up these things in the movies themselves. Like there was not much in GVK that really set up. There was a, a slave village of other apes in the whole earth. Um, so, I'm sure after this movie, it's going to be really up to speculation on what that could possibly be. I feel like there won't be a lot of hints. It would be cool, though, because like I said, he, he said he wants to make a trilogy, so... It would be pretty neat. If we, I think Bio would be great. Bio is such a cool monster. I, she does not get used enough. She's one of my favorite Godzilla monsters. Uh, I guess I'll head over that way for the save. For anyone watching the stream, how's the quality maintaining? Because on gameplay end, I'm not lagging probably should have a piece of wood by me to punch whenever I say stupid stuff like that out loud, but I, I'm still remembering this, I am just touching it out. So. Oh, Phoenix is being chased again, okay. I don't know what I'm doing right now. Okay, um... I'm gonna try to lead her away from you. <sighs> Damn. Good time I got her. Too 
gems left. Not the worst spot. Okay, it looks good around right okay. What the Hattie? Not Hattie. I'm sure the Hattie earlier. Jill. <laughs> I... I need to try out the RE games. I'm not gonna lie. I've been curious about playing them for years. But I'm really excited for this year. Oh shit. Phoenix. Maybe I can... Mm, nah, damn, she picked you up. GDs. What I'm really excited for this year, well, I'm hoping it comes out this year. If it doesn't come out this year, I'll be a little sad, but I'm very excited for uh, the Silent Hill 2 remake. I never got to play it before. I have the PS2, like, I could get it and play it. I mean, it would cost, like, my liver, but, like, I would, I really want to try it. Oh, God. Alright, I'm gonna have to use this. No, I don't. Tree tip. Oh, God. Yeah, it would probably cost my soul to play on the PS2. Like, like I can totally do it. I had the PS2. I played a game called Draken Guard a few months ago on it. Um, but I never played the original Silent Hill games. This will be my first opportunity, and I can play Silent Hill too. So it's like, I loved. I know this might be controversial. Oh God. I'm. I don't know. This might be, uh, controversial, but, uh, I played, uh, I played that, that, what's it called? The, the short game, the short message. I played that one. I actually liked it. It was like that two hour long short game. I really liked it. I thought, I thought it was fun. I thought some of the dialogue was a little corny, like, too much, but I overall liked what it was trying to do, and I thought it was a good Silent Hill game for them. Or, I should, since it was, I've only played, the only one I want to play with PC. That was a good, like, thing for modern age. You know, it tackled some topics that are good. And, yeah, I'm hoping this sound, I know I've heard the community is kind of scared about I heard there's a new movie this year, too, though. Like, I heard there's a, uh, a new Silent Hill movie that's going to be based off, uh, Based off of Silent Hill 2. Oh my god, I. That was. I can't believe I went for that. I'm. <laughs> anyways. Yeah, so I heard there was gonna be a. Uh, a movie based on uh, that. The second game. Ah, fuck. Oh my god, I'm so bad at my dead hand timer right now, what is this? But, I heard the movie's gonna be based off games and game these things, so I'm, I'm excited. Now, my buddy was telling me there was something with it that apparently the fandom's not very happy about. I don't know, I'm not in the Silent Hill fandom, so this is all fresh to me, so like... I like, I'm a, I like the fact that I'll have the opportunity to like, see something like this for the first time and not have like a predetermined opinion you know I remember back in the day when I watched the AOT movies like I'm a huge AOT fan now like I love Attack on Titan but like I actually started with the live action movies and I didn't mind them too much back in the day but I watch them now and I'm like I would have hated them like absolutely despise them if I had watched those first Oh yeah, Sable Ward Gang. Sorry, let me read this up. They show Destroyer. 
Like, they could do Destroya, but, like, I don't... I don't know if I'm really... Like, I don't know. I don't really need a monster to destroy it, to be honest. I would rather have Space Godzilla. Or Violanta. I've seen the concepts, like, the fan-made Space Godzilla designs, and dude, like... Ah, oh, dude, the Space Godzilla concepts I've seen, like, he looks so cool. And Violante, I mean, she just... She just fits. Like... It's... She just... She just does. <laughs> But yeah, I, yeah, I agree. I, I would say for now, keep Dust out of the verse. Uh, bring in, bring back Ghidorah, honestly, before you do that. Like, like, do like a Mecha King Ghidorah. I have 180 of these maps. Okay, I'm bringing party streamers. Um... I think that could King of the World you could do. My King of the World, I am not the biggest Gigan person. Like I like some of the Gigans. Um like, I love Gemstone and Showa guy again. I'm not a big Millennium guy again guy. But, I, I, I don't know if I want guy again most of this either. I know Michael wanted him back in the day. He got a sequel, but at the moment, it doesn't seem like that's going to happen. Although, he did work on, uh, uh, what's it called? He did work on Monarch. Yeah, no, so, like, Hedora, it's super weird we haven't even got a mention of Hedora yet, because, like, I don't know if you know, like, I don't know if you're as much as, like, a monsterverse, like, like, I don't know how deep you've dug into, like, the verse, um, like, the deeper lore, but they have this whole event, like, they have this whole event that got mentioned once in the monsterverse lore, Never explained, we don't know, like, what the importance of it is, nothing, there's, there's no info on it, and it's called the smog, of, like, sometime in the 18, uh, hundreds, and, uh, it's super random, because it got brought up once during King of the Monsters, like, it, it was some new lore, and then they just, just, there's nothing, <laughs> like, they don't, they haven't brought up why they even made that like we don't know the importance of it we have zero clue uh we have zero clue why it was even introduced we don't like we know nothing about it so like the only thing i could think was that it's damn sorry the only thing i could think was that it would involve like hedora but i don't know we never like just never I'm back to it. Oh my god, why am I playing like this? Remember when I was church streaming and talking? I'm used to like listening to music. <laughs> but yeah, I don't I think I, you know what the worst part is? If they do bring Hanadora, I guarantee you they won't even go back to that. Like <laughs> they won't they will never touch on that topic again. They will never, it's just something that they brought up and we'll never get an answer on why, what that was, why it was important, like, oh man. It was just one of those things that was just mentioned because like, hey, we need more lore, like, I, I doubt they thought that far ahead, but it just kind of sucked.
Unbreakable. Uh, is he gonna slug for the 4k? If he slugs for the 4k, I'm just actually. Well, of course he picks me up first. God. Okay. Fair enough. I'm just hoping he's gonna pick that guy up. I'm just gonna drop the pallet on These past few games have got better, but don't worry, we'll we'll come back. Just not this one. I did see someone say oops, oops. I did see someone say something I'm not gonna do that. Am I gonna do a video on how strong GSK is? Potentially. Uh I know I'm gonna help her on or go be trying to do his. I had a, uh, I had an unknown gamer that, uh, uh, it was going, it was a really good unknown game. Well, not I, I, I was, it was one of those games that I was actually doing pretty good. But I had this thing, man, on that thing, she just, oh, she did, she did absolutely nothing. And, while I was being chased, and the other girl was like, down. She just would not save this chick that was on hook the entire time I was, uh, looping the unknown. Showa monsters. I, I mean, I guess it doesn't have to be show exclusive, but like Showa has like the biggest roster. There are other show monsters that, like, I wonder if that would like fit really good as like a big boss in the monsterverse. We already have Mecha Godzilla, obviously. Uh, Mecha Godzilla. Mecha Godzilla is exceeded just a show monster. He's just you know, he's something else. But I feel like uh. Uh, okay, I feel like Megalon. I don't know if I mentioned him earlier. I feel like you could do something with Megalon. I'm not gonna lie. Like, Gemstone Megalon changed my mind. Like, Gemstone Megalon was so cool. <laughs> um, I, th I think you could do something with Megalon.
I'm still trying to think of other show I want to see. Gabra, obviously. No. But, uh... Show had a lot of the goofy ones, you know. I mean, there's some cool Zone Fighter. Has anyone watched Zone Fighter here? Because I've actually watched quite a bit of Zone Fighter. Zone Fighter has a few cool monsters. Zone himself, I think, is cool. I mean, if you read, I don't know if you guys have read the new MonsterVerse comic, The Hunt, but, uh, I mean, it introduced a Jaeger, <laughs> so, like, at this point, you can do a lot more. Like, I, I wasn't expecting a Jaeger to come into the verse. Like, not actually a Jaeger, obviously, but it's like, they, they introduced, uh, a big, big humanoid robot. You know, there's some cool monsters you could bring in, but not really big bosses from Showa. A lot of the big, like, almost every Heisei movie had, like, a giant boss. Like, look at Showa compared to Heisei, and, like... And, yeah, as you are saying with going off Gabra, I mean, look at Singular Point. I think, I think Singular Point. Like, I think Singular Point did fantastic. Some of its stuff. Like, it's version of Gabra, which is called Salunga. <laughs> but, yeah, this version of Gabra was pretty good. I'm not the biggest Ultima guy either. I like him more than, uh... Uh... I like him more than Shin. Um... Like, ability-wise, his design's a bit weird. I think visually and stuff like that, they did a good job of presenting him. But... Um, here's the reason I compare him to Shin, because he's, like, basically Shin 2.0. Like, yeah, I agree. The guys just are so off, and yeah, Terrestrius is cool. I actually have a figure of Terrestrius. I got the SH Monsters of Ultima, but it's like, I don't like it. <laughs> oh god. Oh no. I'm a knight. Oh man. Knight's such a cool, like, concept for a killer. But... Oh, sorry dude. I didn't mean the sandbaggy. If I even did. Oh, I didn't even. You know, he, he just one thing. That's fair. No? Wait, what? Yeah, the terrestrial is cool, though. I wish they made an SH monster of him. Granted, I don't really collect SH anymore just because SH is like. Uh, <laughs> Haya exists now, and Haya is so much better. We're.
I'm really excited for the high, uh, I'll be getting the high uh, Evo Goji. Oh my god! Does he respect me? Oh my! You know, I, I'm actually also really excited for Haya's um, Kong they're going to do for GSK because I have the original GSK Kong they did. It looks fantastic, but the articulation on it is one of the few things SH has beat on the fact that SH quality. Um, but, man, I would... Uh, I'm gonna really going to love... Cause I don't know if you've seen the Skull Island ones, but the Skull Island figure is really good. Like, from what I've seen at least of it so far, the articulation is so much better. I'm assuming... Haya, that's one thing I really respect about Haya, they seem to take criticism and listen. Hopefully they do that with their Ghidorah, too. I know the Ghidorah, there's been a lot of critiques on their Ghidorah. I haven't got the original Ghidorah yet. Hopefully that re-release one they do, like the Beam one, to take those stuff into account. Hey, what's up, King Thunderstar? Oh god, I just jumped into the middle of a chase, I didn't mean to. He's gonna probably chase me. What's up, Tyler? Maybe? No, he went in there. Okay, he's on you. I'm gonna go for the save if I can. No, he's not. Oh, he's right there. Is he gonna proxy? Not exactly. I can't blame him. Like, I, I, I can't. Maybe I can... Alright, he's after me. No, no, he dropped chasing me. Yeah, he really wants to be dead. Uh... Oh, danger person is gonna go for it. Hmm... There are no pallets over here at all. <gasps> oh god, I'm gonna eat this. Oh, I, I, I'm juking, juking the bot. Oh my god, I spun the bot. Uh, we should add AI killers, that'd be cool. Like, I know the Terminator bot sort of thing, but it'd be nice. Oh my god. It'd be nice if, like, Killer DC, if they had a bot pick over for them, too. And, and custom games, too. I'd like to train against some of the killers. Maybe. Uh, I think it'd be cool. And they, they clearly have the AI made, but I think it's not comfortable enough to put it in the system yet. 
I didn't realize how close that dude was. Oh shit. I'm not sure which door you did for next. I'm assuming you did the back door. I could take a trade. I'm on my first one. But can I even get the trade in without just dying? See if I can sneak in the trade. Oh no. Good. Alright, I'll try to trade with him if I or I mean even better if I don't. I don't know. Do I like high flyer wrestlers? Funny enough, because that's how my channel started, was it was like wrestling based. I have Unbreakable. Do mm. you want to pick me up? If he slugs me, no, he's coming back. He's not going to slug. That's fine. I have plenty of time to work with. But yeah, I actually started this channel because I was a big wrestling fan back in the day. And, uh, we had this tag team that we used to post videos at the very start called the High Flyers. <laughs> and then I just kept the name. I thought about changing it repeatedly, but everyone really liked the name High Flyers, so I never did. Hogan? That's a funny one. Yeah, <laughs> the Hulkster. I don't think I like Cena and CM Punk and The Rock and all of them. Nowadays, I don't really watch wrestling as much anymore, but nowadays I like Rollins and uh, uh, Randy's great, obviously. You can never go wrong with Randy. Um, they just pop the door open. Oh, I hope this girl ain't going for the trade. This guy. I think this guy needs to grab me right now. Yep. Perfect. Oh my god. Four man. Oh no. Oh no. Wait. Oh. Maybe I shouldn't have left. Is she fine? Is she fine? Okay, she got out. I was like... Alright, GG's. I know. See, the trade was worth it. <laughs> oh, I got so scared. I was... <laughs> I was about to die, but... GG's, good game. This all feels very familiar. I know, I was extremely close to dying. I kind of shit myself a little bit there. I was, cause that dude, I don't know where you were at, Phoenix, I didn't see you, but they were like, the injured girl and him were like, <laughs> both taking turns getting closer to me. Luckily he went for the injured girl, and... I gave him time. I 
I, I saw you were injured, so... That game went a lot better though. <laughs> the first few games, I really was like, other than the fact I suck against Huntress, the other one, I was just like, Oh my god, I'm not used to talking and playing as much lately. I've been mostly just been listening to music while I play lately. Very relaxing. See, I almost only play Survivor. No, I, one of my biggest things I hate is that I'm a console player. So, like, when you get me in the open, like, I have to get really lucky to get out of that situation. Like, I feel pretty comfortable, obviously, around a lot of pallets and vaults and stuff, but I'm in the open. You're not going to see me doing some of the crazy techs you're going to, you see, like, the guys with keyboards and mouses doing. Like, I, I've, I've spun people, obviously. Like, you can still do it on console, but, like, against a good player, good luck spinning it. Yeah, I just got done taking a break, like, a month ago. I came back, so I was taking a huge break from this game. I was pretty burnt out, and I, I did not like this game uh, at some point. Um, I thought a lot of the mechanics just were getting bad. Yeah, this map sucks. Um, <laughs> yeah, I agree. Uh, I thought a lot of the mechanics were kind of bad. There were huge issues with camping and stuff. And yes, hi, hi, Michaela. I real quick, I downloaded WWE the other night, and uh, someone made a Michaela in the game. Dude, it looks just like her. Like, <laughs> it's like scary how much it looks like her. I wonder if I can pull off a stable. I would just need her blank face, a leg. Uh oh. Ooh, with a crown. And ruin. <laughs> but. Yeah, um. Like. I came. I, I, I deserve that. I fucked up. But. I came back around a month ago because of, uh. Well, for one thing, I really was digging this the whole concept of this DLC, the whole thing's like a DLC. I got back on one night just to try the game again on my own. Um, and I ended up having fun. Like, because uh, I saw a UE cosmetic that I really wanted. I ended up not getting it still. Like, uh, oh my god. I still have yet to actually, ooh, whoops. I still have yet to actually get that cosmetic, but, um, there's a UU cosmetic I really like. I was like, well, I'm gonna grind for that for a few days, until I see what the chapter, like, is when it gets revealed. Then they did the reveal, and the PTB, and I'm like, dude, I'm like, I love this. <laughs> like, unknown, looks like a Trevor Henderson monster, I just got stuck. Oh, damn. Visible wool. wool. Um, but, uh, yeah, I was like, I'm known like a cool Trevor Henderson monster. Sable just, dude, that's just, I don't know what it is this past year with me and white-haired girls in video games, but, like, yeah, I was like, Sable, that's my new main. Um, and the new map looked cool, and it's like, it just all looks good, and it got me excited 
I quit caring about the, the Huey cosmetic, and I started playing the game to play it, and I'm like, a lot of the issues I used to have in this game are just gone. Like, camping's not really a problem anymore. Tunneling's still around, but I can deal with tunneling more than I can deal with camping, because camping's just boring, you know, there's no fun in being camped. At least when you're being tunneled, like, you're still playing, you have a chance to, like, do stuff. Like, I'd rather be tunneled than camped. Um, so I can deal with tunneling a bit more. Like, it's still not the most fun thing, but, like, at least you're still playing. Um, but camping was just horrible. Like, I, I hated it. Um, and I feel like I'm not the only one who's like that. But, um, yeah, and there's just other, there was other perk changes. There's just, there's just a lot of stuff they, they've done with the game that I had played it, like, I played it for like a night or two with like a friend there for a while. Like, I play it like once in a while. But like, I, the changes this game's made did not really hit me until, cause I hadn't hardly played it in a year. So like the changes this game made didn't really hit me until I started playing it again, like fully like this. And I'm like, oh wow, this is a lot better. I'm like, I'm having fun, this feels like a new game. Here I am playing it. Mostly been playing it alone, because like, usually I just, well, it's doing usually Saturday sometimes, Sundays, I'm like the only days I really know I'm going to be available to play with other people. I haven't really been playing with anyone else lately though. But, no one else has really been available lately on Saturday and Sunday, so I've mostly been playing alone, but it's given me a lot of time to just relax and try to better myself at this game. Nothing wrong with that. The Fridays lately, for the most part, usually I get home from work and I just pass out from just exhaustion, or there's another buddy well, I'm playing with another buddy of mine and watching him play another game or something. I've just been busy usually on a lot of Fridays. Um, and then just on the weekends now, I, I haven't really been playing with anyone else, so... I've been playing this game alone and doing other stuff, or just RC stuff, so... It brings the worst out of you. Video games used to bring pretty bad sides out of me. Like, a few years ago, some friends I used to play with stuff, like, I would get mad and stuff, but, like, you know, I feel like I've grown. Since then, I don't get as mad as easily. You know, stuff doesn't bring out the toxicity in me as easily when it comes to video games. Like I'm just having fun. It's a video game. I kind of came to realize that. Like the stuff I used to do back when I was like graduating high school, like that doesn't really mean anything now. Oh my god. Um. So it's like I don't really think about a lot of that. Oh. Okay. See. See, that was one of the rare times I could actually spin someone on console. Uh, oh. Fight my demons. Okay. Oh, this game's just been fun lately. Right, so I got WWE though. Well, a couple buddies of me, love mid did Some buddies of mine want me to get a new Battlefront collection, which I heard is not that good. <laughs> and then Hell Drivers too. Which I've seen a little bit of gameplay of. It looks fine. Yeah, it looks like something I can have fun on. I'll just have to play it. See. Two K fourteen is pretty good. I like two K thirteen more though. Not two K thirteen. Forgive me. Thirteen, because that was the last game before two K got their hands on the WWE license. But yeah, this game's so much better now than the last time I played it like this. Like, I think the burnout went away, plus they've just made the right changes to make me want to play this game again. I gotta be down to play it with whoever. Um, nice, nice adrenaline. Um, I'm be down to play it with whoever. I've been having fun on it. I might get burnt out again at some point, I'm sure. I think that's natural. That happens with any video game. But right now I'm having fun, so... Oh, 
first you getting chased up. See, I hate losing, I can hate losing too, but like, to me, okay, so first off, I play Survivor more than Killer, because I'm not that good as Killer, but I feel alright as Survivor, and plus, I just like having a team. I like I'm a multiplayer type of guy. So I like that feeling of having, which is why I love being Killer in Texas Chainsaw Massacre, because then I can be the Killer and have teammates. Um... But, oh, she's still on that David. Um, yeah, Survivor is nice, and normally a win to me is that I got my 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 pip and my my blood points out of it. Like I could die on two gens or something, but like if I got my blood point value out of it, my challenges, whatever, like, my tip, like, good enough for me. I'm gonna have to open the sword. GG's. I don't think they're going to fix the bloodshot options. Have they said they're going to? I don't see why they would at this point. Like, I don't think there'd be a point to. Hey, thank you for the sub. Yeah, rune, rune. Not that good. You should have ran pop. Um... That was a, that was a two game. Cool. Bomb button. Yeah, killer. That's a, when I do get back into killer. So part of my issue with killer is that I spent so much time playing this game on survivor side, leveling up survivors, getting survivor teachable, stuff like that. That like, dude, <laughs> like. I have so many teachables on killer side that I don't have unlocked, and... Yeah, you can let me know. I wouldn't mind. See, I like playing online right now, at the moment, with the Blood Moon event going on, since it's like... Here, let's see, I think it's like a 300 multiple. Yeah, we're on like... We're on like 300... Times... Blood points right now. I'm gonna see if I can get Sable to like, at least level 20 before the event ends. And like, once this event ends though, we could talk about doing some private games and stuff. Like I said, a lot of my weekends right now, when I'm playing this, in between I'm just doing other stuff, but. I do get on throughout the week too, but not for long. Hey, have a good day. Thanks for coming to the stream, man. I know I got some other buddies who are hopping on this game soon at some point. So. I do appreciate that. I'm hoping Unknown looks very fun. I really like Unknown. I like Unknown's design. I like him in concept. Like... I'm hoping that, like, right now, like I said, I'm, I think I'm going to go for level 20 Sable, at least, and then, <coughs> afterwards, okay, so, you can see right here, I have Teachables unlocked for 
most of my survivors, there's a few I'm missing. Granted, not all these are that important, but like it's just kind of one of those completion things, you know, just to have. I, th I think that makes sense. I do need to get a couple of these survivors. But on the killer side, I don't have teachables for, like, shit. <laughs> so, I definitely would have to work on getting the teachables on the survivor side at some point. Or on the killer side. I feel like I can play killer. I've been playing Xeno when I'm playing it, but I don't have the best build because I just kind of got to work with what I got. And plus, luckily, too, with, with killer side, you have bots you can practice with. Not the same as people. But at least that's an option. Because I've done it before. Like, at least you can practice with bots, too. Survivors, I just wish they would add, like, a killer bot. You know? I know it wouldn't be the best, but... It'd be nice if you want to practice some stuff with Survivor. Yeah, Unknown's awesome. He truly is. I don't know who came up with him, but... Checking something super fast. Haddonfield. Oh, we're facing Chucky? Wait, how'd you know that? Chucky's a fun one, I like. Chucky's a goofy little fucker. I kinda like going against him. Oh yeah. Chucky's such a neat killer too. I'm hoping with the introduction of Chucky, they figured out how to do like short killers and stuff. Can we please get a crawler? Like a crawling killer? Like, dude, that'd be so awesome. Like, I want a killer that, when I say crawling, I don't mean, like, a Xeno where, like, he's crawling half the time. I mean, like, a killer that's always crawling. Like, an un until Dawn Wendigo, I think, could work. Although, they stood up sometimes, so that wouldn't really. But, like, I would love a killer that just, entire time, just, on all fours. Cause you could do, you could do, like, look at the way they did with Chucky, you could see, like, the footprints through the walls and stuff. I think it'd be cool. I was hoping the unknown was, and I think I was gonna like the unknown, if it wasn't a crawling killer, but then, the, then what we got ended up being sick, too, so I was like, you know what? Nah, it's fine. I posted on my Instagram story the other day, but I just saw the Wesker jump scare I had happen. I was getting chased by a Wesker in this building I'm in, and he went and hid while he was chasing me. I didn't know he went and hid. He had Insidious or something. I didn't even check after the match. Maybe he had some perk that turns off his hair radius. I'm assuming it was Insidious. I went to walk back in the house thinking he dropped chase with me. And he just came walking out and just, oh, dude, absolutely scared me.
Yeah, I'm waiting for minus one to come out on Blu-ray and DVD still. So. I know it's coming out in May in Japan, but there's no info on when it's coming out in America. Come on, Chucky. Oh, let's go chase him. I need... Hey. I mean, if you want my ass, you want my ass, but I would like some chase points, please. <laughs> What's Chucky doing? Oh, he gave up. He gave up? Oh god. Oh, I spun him. Oh my god. Oh, I need that. Oh, I got a ping lag there. I guess I'll go save that Claudi. Hmm. Friends till the end. I might wait a second on that save. Oh my god, never mind. Here first, hope okay, at least. I'll just heal up and come get her. I'll just heal up and come back and grab you. Actually, I think they're gonna beat me to it. Or the Claudette? Or who opened the door? Is it Chucky? I didn't see the thing pop up on her thing. Oh, I, that's what I was thinking, because I didn't notice the door icon on the Claude thing. That's fine. Spinning around. I think we broke him. Oh god. Oh wait. Yeah, we're good. <laughs> okay, we broke him. I How'd you know it was Chucky? Really? I thought you only get loading tips if, uh, you haven't really faced that killer that much. Yeah, me either. I was like, there was a point where I was in the building. I doubt you're watching my stream. I don't know if you were, but there was a point where I was in the building and, oh, uh, that makes sense. I was in the building, I was trying to get him to come chase me and he just kind of looked at me funny. A 
moon event is so good for blood points. No, hey man, it's all good. Thanks for uh, hopping in. Um, yeah, man. Yeah, I mean, we can always play again sometime, so. Oh, Nicholas Cage. But, yeah, thanks for hopping in and playing for a bit. I might not stream too much longer anyways, so. But. Alright, man. Yeah. Have a good day. Alright. So. Yep, talk to you later too, man. Alright, let's, let's get at least a couple more in. So does anyone know where to find the GSK Funkos? I was looking at Target and GameStop last night, and I didn't see them at either or. Dude, his eyes. <laughs> that name, his eyes. Andy Graves. Is that... Who's that? Is that a Resident Evil skin? playing RE characters, aren't they? I'm gonna be that guy. <laughs> nice. Some party streamers. I wish I could get more of those. <laughs> Sadly, the blood web ain't that nice. Is that blight? Yeah, it's blight. So this can go one of two ways. Let's, we're about to find out. So everyone's still in the stream. As I'm sure we've had plenty of people coming out. How's everyone's day going? I'll have, I recorded a couple Godzilla PS4 videos earlier, or I'll post them here in a little bit. Oh boy. Oh, he does have ruin. I don't need to drop that. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Oh my god. Okay, I could probably play around this one for a minute. Oh shit. Oh god. Nice. Good shit, man. What? Wait, what? Why, why'd he do that? Why'd that? 
Wait, why did it double? Why did it do that? I. Damn, I did that wrong. No, good stuff, man. I was curious on why it like double made him do the double shot. Hey, was that a visual glitch on my end? No, I'm not lagging. Do this gen over here. He back on me? Oh shit, he is. No? Yeah? yeah. Alright, so I'm gonna take an M1. That's okay. I could probably act the M1. It's fine. Okay. How's he gonna play this? Neat. I like that, I respect it. <laughs> oh, I hit dead hard, damn. I played. <laughs> I hit the dead hard button. I guess I'll just have to hit it a little sooner from now on. But it's not saying he's having ping issues, so I'm not having ping issues. Fair enough, though. That person's death hook. Oh, hey, there's a dream. I might just say fuck it and break that for shits and giggles. Oh god.
Is he looking for me? What's he doing? I want these points. Give me, give me value. Oh, that wasn't- Oh, y'all, you sly dog. I didn't realize he already came around. Oh. GG's. Probably do one more on the stream. And then call it at least on the stream. Next game we'll get level six P sixteen. Damn, that dude's P one hundred. Oh, this sable has me beat. Fairy girl. I wonder if Fortnite's gonna start the Avatar. I haven't checked that in a bit. Fortnite's gonna start the Avatar crossover. I'll be playing that.
Hmm. I need to kill her. That's a uh, pony, right? Oh my god. Oh my, okay. Well, GG's. Yeah. Oh, at least we know a couple of the perks. I mean, I kind of expected it when I saw the enduring, but... Stay walls coming to get me. No? Oh, dude, dude, be my hero, please, please. Oh, okay. If they haven't got the theater done, that would probably be the next best gen to do. Last one I need it. There we go. Alright, so hopefully he decides to never come up here and check. I really like how when you pop this gen the movie starts playing. I wonder if there's lore in that movie. Like that they play.
think we're good. Oh, hello. Oh. Poor bear. Alright. Well, I think that's where I'm going to end this stream. Good test. It seems I've been going for almost two hours and uh, it seems the stream just went down in quality, but it didn't die. So, that's mostly what I was checking for. So. What's up, Evolved Godzilla 2024? Can't wait for your movie next week. And that's the rift on. Cool. Alright. Great. Is that a banner? Ah. It's neat. Okay. Alright. Well, hope you all have a good day. Take care. Thanks for coming. And yeah, maybe we'll go on ahead then. This ran pretty well, so maybe we'll run a stream here on like Wednesday or Thursday before I go to the movie or something like that. So, and we'll see. I'm going to actually watch the movie on Thursday when I do a review of it. I don't know. I'm going to do a first thoughts. I'm not going to do a full fledged review. It'll probably be like what I did for minus one, but. Which I never got back to doing a full-fledged review on that movie. But I'll definitely talk about it a bit, I'm sure. I'd be shocked if I don't. But, alright. Hope everyone has a great day. Enjoy your Sundays. As always, peace out. And...